we can do about it. Now, you've made America Freedom of Fascism. I want to walk through that film, and I want to encourage everybody out there to, to uh, get a copy of it on DVD. It was also in theaters around the country, and the, I think the best film out there in the Federal Reserve and the IRS and the whole banker scam. I want to discuss that with you here. Uh, but I wanted to uh, go back a little bit uh, to the point that we discussed uh, last night where you don't advise people to not pay. And I do the same thing. People say, well, wait, you're saying it's a scam, but you're saying, well, I didn't pay it. And I like the way you summed it up. Well, it's really fairly simple. I mean, uh, since making that movie, you know, many people come to me and ask me whether they should pay their income taxes or not. You know, and I never advise people not to pay. And the reason I, I tell them, I say, look, I've done a lot of research. There is, the Supreme Court has ruled that the IRS has no authority. The 60th Amendment did not give the IRS the authority to tax your labor and your wages. That's a fact. All right? The Supreme Court is the law of the land, you know, and, and, the, and the IRS does not trump the Supreme Court. However, that being the case, the fact is if the mafia would come to you and say, we want $2,000 a month that we're going to hurt you, I would not advise you not to pay them. Because you may get hurt by not paying them. Whether it's legal or not, doesn't necessarily matter. You're going to get hurt if you don't. It's the same thing with the IRS. They can hurt you. They can put you in jail. They can torture you. So if you don't pay them, you may get hurt. So I never advise people not to pay. You know, I tell people, yeah, pay your taxes. Look what happened to Congressman Hanson. Yeah, Congressman Hanson is a great example. Pay your taxes. But you know what? Shut down the Federal Reserve System, and eventually you won't have to pay those taxes anymore. See, the, the, the IRS is a symptom of the problem. The real problem is the, is the banking industry and the bankers in this country. That's where the real problem lies. That's the root of our problem. That's why we've lost America. Okay? So, yeah, pay your taxes. Because if you don't pay them, you might get hurt. And I've heard all the arguments, you know, uh, how, what tax protesters say and so on and so forth. And I don't call them tax protesters. I call them the tax honesty movement. Instead of being honest, you know, at least. But the fact of the matter is, you're being forced, you're being compelled to pay it because you're facing jail sentences, you're facing time, you're facing corruption of the courts if you don't pay, right? And so you pay it, because you just like you pay the mafia. But with the mafia, at least you have the government to call and try and help you to get past the mafia, to protect you. Here you have nobody to protect.